Hello everyone. Uh, today I will explain you how to find the determinant of matrix uh, 3 by 3 of the matrix uh, 3 by 3. Take 3 by 3. Is 3 by 3. So uh, the first we have many ways to find about this matrix, uh, to find the determinant of this matrix. We can show by series, we can show by uh, row, we can show by uh, column, we can show by cofactor expansion, and we can show by reduced row. So the first I start to explain you how to find this matrix by series. Before we start our this matrix by series, we write about the determinant of A. Determinant of A, we can write absolute of A, this one, and equal to, equal to this one, I write minus four, uh, 2 minus 9 and this one is 3 is 4 is 1 and this one is 1 minus 3 and 2 so about the series method if we have metric 3 by 3, 3 by 3, we just to add about two columns of the metric A. The two columns of metric A, I can add the first column 1, 3, uh, minus 4, 1, 3, uh, 3, 1, and the two column is 2 is 4 and minus 3. So I add column 1 and column 2. It means that I add column 1 and column 2 to this one. And then we just to write about this one. We think about this one by my arrow, this one, and this one, and this one. So the sign is plus, plus, this plus. Now I get about this determinant of A, I can write absolute of A is equal. 4 times 4 is 16. 16 times 2 is minus 32. This one is 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 1 is 2. So it is plus this one 9 times 3 times 3 is minus 9 minus 3 3 times 3 is 9 9 times 9 is 81 so this one is 81 this is all about this sign and we start about this one again Start from the bottom to the top. This one, I write this one is minus, minus, but this one is minus 9, minus, multiply with minus is plus. So this one is 1 times 4 is 4, 4 times 9 is 36. So I get 36. And then this one. 
minus and minus is plus plus this one is minus because this sign is minus 3 times 1 is 3 3 times 4 is 12 so this one is minus 12 and the last one this 2 times 3 is 6 6 times 2 is 12 so this one is minus 12 now I get the determinant of A is equal this one is 30 30 81 minus 30 is 51 51 this one 36 minus 21 is plus 12 plus 12 so it is we get 60 63 so the determinant of a is 63 this is resolved by about the uh, serious formula and now we just go to another strategy I saw by row uh, formula with row I just change the color formula by row by row so the determinant of a determinant of a is equal if i choose row 1 if i choose row 1 or row 3 is up to me if i choose row 1 is a11 c11 plus a12 a12 c12 plus a13 c13 so we got a11 in here i write a11 is equal to minus 4 minus 4 a12 equal to uh, 2 and a13 equal to minus 9 and about C11 C11 is equal it means that we have the formula C i j equal to minus 1 power i plus j m i j m i j is minor you know about this point in our relation so 1 plus 1 is 2 2 minus 1 or negative 1 power 2 is 1 so i just write only m11 m11 it means that you omit column 1 and the row 1 this one so we get about m11 is and right here is 4 1 and minus 3 2 so it's equal to 8 plus 3 equal to 11 
now I get C12. C12, 1 plus 2 is 3, so it is minus M12 equal to minus M12. Column 1, uh, sorry, M12 is column 1, uh, row 1, this one is row 1, and column 2. So we just omit column 2. Now we get about M12 is 3, 1 and 1, 2 is equal to minus 6 minus 1 is equal to minus 5 and we find about C1, 3 C1, 3, 1 plus 3 is 4 is positive so M 1, 3 equal to M 1, 3 it means that row 1 and column 3 so I omit row 1 and column 3 this one we have oh, I omit this one we have about 3 3 4 and 1 minus 3 minus 3 yeah sorry minus 3 so we get this one is minus 9 and minus 4 is minus 13 now we get already a11 a12 a13 c11 c12 c13 so i get the determinant of matrix a is a11 is minus 4 m11 is 11 plus a12 is 2 m12 is minus 5 and a13 is minus 9 M13 is minus 13. So I get this one is minus 44, minus 10, and plus. This one is 27, we write 7, carry 2, 1, 1, 2, and this one. So is equal to one hundred and seventeen minus two fifty four fifty four. So this one we get is sixty three. Now we can compare about this. Solution of this answer is 63, and this answer also 63. This one I use by the determinant, find determinant by row. Now I can find about the, this determinant by column. I can choose another column. I choose another column of uh, metric A. I write metric A again in here because it's over. We cannot see. 
is equal to uh, minus 4, 2, minus 9. This one is 3, 4, and 1. This one is 1, minus 3, and 2. This is metrically. So I find the determinant of this metric. Uh, determinant of metric A is equal to, I use about row 1, uh, column 1. I can write A11 C11 plus A21 C21 plus A31 uh, C31 but A11 A11 is minus 4 a21 is uh, 3 and a31 is 1. C11 we find already. C11 is defined at the top is C11 is 11. C11 is 11. 11. So I just find about C21. 2 plus 1 is 3. 3 is negative. M21. M21 it means that row 2 and column 1 row 2 and column 1 this one so we get this point is equal to negative of 2 and minus 9 minus 3 and 2 or negative 3 and 2 so this one is negative. This one is 4. This one is negative and negative is positive. So minus 27. So it is minus or negative 23 and negative is 23. I get C31. Equal to this one is four, so I get M three one. M three one it means that row three, row three. Uh oh, let me check. row 2 and column 1 okay yeah and this one m31 it mean row 3 and column 1 and we get this one is equal to 2 minus 9 2 is minus 9 and this one is 4 and 1 it's equal to 2 this one is minus 36 minus and minus is plus 36 so it is 38 
Now we get determinant of A. Determinant of A is equal to A11 minus 4 and 11. C11 plus A12 is 3. M uh, A21 is 3. M21 is 23. 23. And A31 is 1. M31 is 38. So we get determinant of the matrix A is equal to this one is minus 44 plus this one is 69 plus this one is 38 so we get this one is 100 100 and uh, 17 this one minus 2 44 so we get it is 60 63 this one is 100 yeah 100 and 7 so we get 60. This is, we can compare by series, also 63, by row, also 63, and the one more thing. One more thing, I think uh, we can. find this determinant by expand cofactor find determinant find determinant Find determinant by cofactor uh, cofactor expand expand. So we get about the matrix A. I write matrix A and the determinant of A determinant of A is equal to equal to this one is minus 4 2 minus 9 and 3 4 and 1. This one is 1 minus 3 and 2. By covector expand, it means like about the row 1 or about the row 2 or so. We can write about this one. This one is determinant of this one is equal to equal to this one is plus so minus 4 and we get about it's minus 4 this one and we omit this one 
so we get the minor is 4 1 minus 3 and 2 and this one is minus 2 right in 2 if we write in 2 we just omit about this one this one and we get minus 2 is 3 1 1 and 2 1 and 2 and the last one is plus plus but it is minus 9 so we get we omit at 9 the last column this one and we have We have this one is 3, 4, 1 and minus 3 or negative 3. Now we get determinant of A. Determinant of A is this one is minus 4. And this one is A plus 3 minus 2 is 6 minus 1 minus 9 is minus 9 minus 4. So the determinant of A is equal to is equal to this one is minus 4 and this one is 11 the result minus 2 and 5 minus 9 and minus uh, this one is 13 so we get determinant of the matrix A is this one is minus 44 minus 10 and plus minus and minus is plus uh, 117 so we get determinant of the matrix A is equal to equal to this one is minus 54 plus 117 so it is equal to uh, 30 uh, 63 this is the result of determinant. So we have determinant or we have one matrix. We can find other determinant by many ways or by any uh, many strategy to find. We can find by series. We can find by uh, row. We can find by column formula, the formula of column. We can find by cofactor expand or another thing we can find with the row operation or row reduction or row reduce row. So I will explain how to find the determinant by our reduce row. By our reduced row,
by our reduce row uh, In this case, I write the metric A, metric A. is equal to uh, minus 4 2 and minus 9 3 and 4 and 1 1 minus 3 and 2 2 so the determinant of A the absolute of A is equal is equal uh, minus 4 2 minus 9 3 4 1 1 minus 3 and 2 and 2 this one so I keep row 1 And I just do row 2 and row 3. I write row 2 is from 4 row 2 plus 3 row 1. And row 3 become from for row three, for row three, and uh, for row three and plus row one. Now I get the matrix. Uh, the determinant. This determinant, I write A. Determinant A is equal to this one is you multiply with 4, so you just divide with 1 over 4. This one is the coefficient is 4, so you write 1 over 4. And the determinant. This one is minus 4, 2, minus 9. This one is 0, 4, this one, and 3, this one. 4, this one, 3, this one is 0. And 4, this one is 16. 3, this row is 6. So it's 22. 22. And this one is 4. 4, this one is 20 seven. Minus 20 seven. 4 minus 20 seven is minus 23. And this one is the row 3 is 0. And for this one, for this one is 12. For this one is 12. Minus 12. Plus this one is 2. So it's minus 10. Minus 10. And this one 4 is 8. 8. And this one is 9. 8 minus 9 is minus 1. And then 
we just to do this one to be zero to be zero so i can write all three all three come from 22 or 3 plus 10 or 2. Now we get the determinant of A is equal to this one 1 over 4 multiply 1 over 4 multiply with this one is the coefficient of all 3 is 22. So it's 1 over 22 is equal to minus 4, 2, minus 9. This one is 0, 22, minus 23. This one is 0, this one is 0. And this one is with 22. This one is with 22. So it is minus 22. And plus this one is with 10 is minus 230. So it's equal to 200 and uh, 52 252 so this one is 200 and 52 the determinant the determinant is determinant is uh, determinant of a is we just take this one 1 over 4 multiplied by 1 over 4 multiplied by uh, this one is 1 over 22 multiply with minus 4 multiply with 22 and multiply with 252 minus yeah this one is minus minus this one is minus so for we can left out with minus 4 this 4 and 22 with 22 so we get our determinant of a is equal to this one have 1 over 4 and minus 1 and minus 20 2052 so we get the determinant of the matrix a is equal minus and minus is plus 252 divide by divide by 4 so we get 60 63 now our reduce row we can uh, find this metric is only uh, 50, 50 uh, 63 so now notice that this point I write in our presentation or my slide already if b matrix b get from matrix a by a row some row we don't know so the determinant of a is equal to is equal to uh, a determinant of b 
if B get from A by row over 2 by row over A so we get the determinant of A or B equal to A determinant of A and if B get from A by row plus or minus the dumping about uh, this one is the number of row so determinant A equal to determinant of B and B get from A by 2 of this one minus or plus uh, that one the row the last row so our point we can write about the determinant of A equal to 1 over 2 determinant of, of B this one and the special case And the special case if they have if they have metric A is A11, A12, A13, N0. A two two A two three zero zero A three three or metric A is A one one zero zero A two one a two two zero A three one A three two A three three or take A is equal to A one one zero 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 A two two zero 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 a three three so the determinant of a the determinant of a is equal to a one one a two two and a three 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 this is the determinant of diagonal matrix and the determinant of triangular matrix triangular matrix. Now I just to explain you some of this uh, strategy of the determinant. If I One example I have, I take some small example for you. I have the metric A. 
Therefore, I have matrix A is equal to I write 2, 5, 1, and 4, this one. So, it's easy to calculate about the determinant A. So, I write determinant of the matrix A is equal to A minus 5 equal to 3. If I change, if I change, example, I get B. B, I change row 1 to row 2 and row 2 to row 1. 1, 4, and 2, 5. This one. So the determinant of B is equal to 5 minus A is minus D. And we get about the determinant of A is equal to minus determinant of B. So it just only different the sign, but the value 3 and 3, the number is 3 also. But different sign, one is positive 3 and one is negative 3. So if I write about one more, this one, I say matrix C, I just change about column 1 to column 2 and 2 to 1. I write about 5, 4, and 2, 1. So the determinant of C, determinant of matrix C is equal to 5 minus 8 equal to minus 3. So in this case, we get determinant A is equal to negative determinant of C. So in the matrix, in the matrix, if I have matrix A, I have matrix A is equal to A11. A12, A21, A22. The determinant is equal to uh, we get the determinant of A is equal to A11 a22 minus a12 a21 but when we change when we change example i write matrix b matrix b is equal to i write a21 a22 A11 A12 So the determinant of B is equal to minus A11 A12 minus A12 A21 and C, the matrix C 
if I write about the I change the column A12 A11 A22 A21 so we get the determinant of C is equal to minus A11 A22 minus A12 A21 this point and then if I have this metric A I write metric D D is equal to equal to I just write about uh, 2 5 and this one is 3 9 so our determinant our this determinant is we get the determinant of D determinant of the matrix D is equal to uh, 89 18 minus 15 is equal to 3 so we get determinant of D equal to determinant of A so if D get from this one, I think uh, the same A11, A12, but this one A21 plus A11 and A22 plus A1. Two. A12 two, determinant of D is equal to determinant of A because this one is get from row 1 plus row 2 plus row 2 or we can about the matrix E. I write matrix E. Uh, matrix E is equal. I change row one. I keep row two is one and four. But row two. So 2, I write 2, row 1, plus 3, row 2, plus 3, row 2, so this one, two row 1 is 4, 4 plus 3 is 7, this one is 7, 2 row 1 is 6 2 row 1 is 6 uh, 5 this 5 is 2 row 1 is 10 10 plus 12 is 22 22 so the determinant determinant of E is equal to this one is 20 uh, 21 20 uh, 
24 this one uh, I think this one is 28 is 28 minus 22 is equal to 6 because we take all 1 2 or 1 plus 3 or 2 our row 1 so it means that determinant of A is equal to determinant of E divided by divided by 2 so it's equal to 6 over 3 equal over 2 is equal 3 so we get the determinant of A is the determinant of A is 3 and the determinant of E is 6 so determinant of E is equal to 3 determinant of A in this case please remember about this property so when we change some other uh, row or column, the determinant is different sign. Different sign. If we divide or we multiply, we can update by this one. By this one. This is the way to find about the determinant. Now I want to explain you about determinant by reduce row one more example because i'm afraid all of you uh, lack of about how to find the determinant uh, by reduce row by reduce row I will take another example. If I get a uh, the metric A, I write metric A here. Metric A is equal to uh, 2, 2 minus 9 is 5. Four and one and eight minus three and two. So we get the determinant of A is equal to. Two, two minus nine is five four one. This eight minus three and two. Now 
we write about this one. I want to convert this one to be uh, upper triangle or lower triangle, up to you, uh, to be triangular. Triangular. So I take all one is from all one. All one get from all one. But all two, I write two or two. Two or two minus five or one. All three, I use two or three minus eight or one. Now the determinant of A is equal to if you find all two but all two have coefficient, you should be right take one divide by coefficient of all two, two. And all three also have coefficient two, one divide by two. And determinant of this one is 2 2 minus 9 and this one is to be 0 because 2 this one is minus 5 this one 2 this one is 8 minus 5 this one is 10 minus 2 So this one is 2, 2 minus and minus plus, and this one is 45, 45, and 2 is 47, 47, this one is 2, uh, 0, and this one is 2, 6, this one is 6, this one by multiplied by 8, is 16 minus 16 minus 6 is minus 22 minus 22 and this one is 4 this one is 4 this one minus minus and this one is minus is plus is 72 72 and 4 72 and 4 plus 4 is 70 76 and then we take this one to be 0 to be 0 so I write all one from all one, all two from all two, but all three want to be zero. In this case, so I write all three minus eleven or two. So our determinant of A is equal to, because this one is number one, number one, and number one. So it's the same. It is not uh, change the determinant. So we write one over two. Multiply with one over two. And this one is 2, 2, minus 9. This one is 0, is minus 2, is 47. This one is 0, this one is 0. Get this one is 70. This one divide by uh, multiply with uh, 
will declare with it means that for is when and is when so we get is when this one is for this one is when is eleven carry one this one uh, okay so when yeah uh, so when for eleven carry one yeah and Now we get this one is uh, minus 36 is 1, this one is 4, this one is 4. So this one we get about uh, minus 401. So the determinant. Because we take this one, or 3 minus 11 of 1. So we take this one is plus, and this one is minus. So this minus. Now the determinant of A. Determinant of A is equal to 1 over 2 multiply 1 over 2 and this one is triangular so we take only the diagonal matrix 2 multiply with minus 2 multiply with minus 41 so we get the determinant of the matrix A is equal to 2 we can get, uh, left out with 2 2 we can left out with 2 it has only minus 1 and minus 441 so we get this determinant is equal to 441 this is the uh, answer of this determinant or the solution of determinant. If we change, if we want to change about the row, it just only put the sign. The sign. Example, I get determinant A. Determinant A here is um, 2 2 9 and 5 uh, 4 and 1 and one more is 8 minus 3 and 2 this one if I change row 1, row 1 and row 3, or row 2 up to you, row 1 and row 3, we get another is determinant of A, I write here, determinant of A is equal to minus, minus, Change 1 to 3, 3 to 1 is 8 minus 3, 2, 5, 4, and 1. This one is 2, 2, and minus 9. Minus nine, and now we just to do this one to be zero, and this one to be zero to be triangle matrix. 
I write O1 O1 is get from O1 and <laughs> two. Uh, this one is five. Uh, we can write eight. Yeah. Eight. I just omit this one. Hello. How are you? How are you? Wait a moment. Then I finish the record, okay? And uh, this one I take uh, 5, 8. 8 or 2 minus or 1 multiplied by 5. And or 3. And 4 or 3. Minus or one. So determinant of A is equal to equal to uh, minus, and this one is coefficient is eight. We can write one over eight. Coefficient of all three is four. We write one over four. And now we get that this one is 8 minus 3, 2. And this one is 0. 0. This one 8 minus this one is 5. 8 is 32. 32 plus 15. Plus fifteen. Plus fifteen is forty seven. So this one is forty seven. And this one is eight. Eight minus ten is minus two. This one is zero. Zero. And for this one minus this one is eight minus and minus is eleven. Eleven. And this one with four is thirty six. Thirty six minus one is oh sorry this one with uh, eight okay. 36 36 minus 2 minus 36 and minus 2 uh, is minus 30 38 this one minus 38 Minus 38. So now we just get this one to be zero. This one to be zero. To be zero. So we get we get about this one is all one from all one. Or two from or two and or three. I write seventy forty seven or three minus eleven or two. So determinant of A is equal to minus one over eight multiplied by one. 
over 4 and this one coefficient is for this one so 1 over 47 and then we get 8 minus 3 minus 2 1 is 0 47 and minus 2 this one is 0 this one is 0 and about this one we multiplication with uh, 74 it means that 8 and 74 this one is 6 5 this one is 21 this one is 32 is 3 5 and 8 8 carry 5 12 and this one so we get this one is minus 1 7 8 6 and minus 11 of all two minus and minus is plus is 22 22 so we get is 4 6 7 and 1 minus so this one is minus uh, 40 so now we get about determinant of a determinant of a is equal to 1 over 8 1 over 4 uh, 1 over 47 multiplied by 8 multiplied by 47 multiplied by minus 1 7 6 and 4 so this determinant of A is 8 left out with 8 for this one left out with 47 minus and minus is plus so it's equal to 1 7 6 4 divide by 4 so this one we can put 4 4 and 1. Now the result of our row operation we change. When we change about the row or we don't change about the row, we keep the original of the metric and we get the same answer or the same solution, uh, the same value, value of determinant is 440, 41. So this is the way of our uh, find about the determinant by uh, find the determinant by uh, sometimes we call about uh, row operation or reduce row or uh, row reduction. Reduction. So this is the, our uh, strategy to find about determinant. I hope this video helped you to know more about determinant when you want to find some determinant with this uh, strategy. And one more thing. I just want to explain you if I have this example I have uh, the metric A I have metric A metric A is 
uh, 4 minus 1 3 and 5 2 1 and minus 2 7 and 0 this one if the question they ask you find find the determinant of a determinant of a minus one determinant of a transposer and determinant of 2a the first we start to find about the determinant of a if they don't let you to find other way we can find some of a uh, determinant by yourself you can choose other uh, way to find or by zeros by row factor uh, by row uh, formula of row or formula of column or about reduced row up to you you can find all this one but for me i just uh, the determinant of a i can write is four Four is I mean this one. This one is have two one six zero six zero and minus minus one. We have five and one minus two and zero and plus three. We have five. 2 and minus 2 7 so the determinant of a right here over here yeah. determinant of a is equal 4 this one is minus 7 so this one 2 and 0 is 0 plus this one is 2 and plus 3. This one is 55 plus 4. So determinant of A is minus 28 plus 2 plus this one is 3 multiply it. 39. So the determinant of A is equal to minus 26 plus this one is when 9 and this one. So we get this one is 91. 91. So the determinant of A Or I can write determinant of A is equal to 91. 91. And when you find determinant of A, you can use You can use determinant of this by the property. By the property. Property it means that we have determinant of A equal to 1 over determinant of a 
power minus 1. So we get determinant of A power 1. Power minus 1 is equal to 1 over determinant of A. So it is equal to 1 over 91. This is the determinant of A power minus 1. And determinant of A is equal to determinant of A transposer. So it is equal to 91. And determinant of 2A is equal to 2. Metric A is 3 by 3. 3 divided by uh, 3, uh, 1 power 3 determinant of A. So we get determinant of to A is equal to is 8 multiplied with A is 91. So we get is 72 and 8. This is the determinant of 2A. In this case, do not, do not find about the inverse matrix of A and find determinant of A or find A transpose A and determinant of A transpose transpose A or find 2A and determinant of 2A it's no need we just uh, use about our property use of our, our property like uh, I mean that our property is our property is Our property is determinant A determinant of uh, sorry, I give uh, I give metric A metric A M N and metric B and by M. So determinant of AB equal to determinant of A multiply with determinant of B of B and determinant of A equal to determinant of A transposer determinant of A multiply with determinant of A power minus 1 is equal to 1. So we can write determinant of A equal to 1 over determinant of A power 1 or determinant of A equal to 1 power minus 1 equal to 1 over determinant of A. 
and about the determinant of k a k is constant constant so determinant of k a is equal to k power n determinant of uh, matrix A, this one. And notice that. Notice that if they have matrix A, I write matrix A, is one 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 two uh, zero this one is zero 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 a two two or uh, I just write uh, for the diagonal metric here yeah. so I write this D one D1, 0, 0, 0, D2, 0, 0, 0, and D3, D3, the determinant of A, determinant of A is equal to D1, D2, and D3. And about the about the inverse of A, I write A power 1, power minus 1 is equal to 1 over D1, 0, 0, 0, 1 over D2, 0, and 0, 0, 1 over D3. This is the Inverse metric of diagonal metric. The inverse metric of diagonal metric. And I just write about the A power K is equal to D1 power K 0, 0, 0, D2 power K 0 and 0, 0, D3 power K. This is the Uh, special uh, metric. Special metric, it means I, I just take uh, only uh, the diagonal metric to, to explain. And the other thing, Now the thing I want all of you I want all of you uh, just right here 
find find determinant 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 find determinant of matrix below below first I write matrix A is equal to just take a uh, one minus three two and three four one then is minus four two and minus nine two is this one is solution solution is minus uh, this one see two is a equal to a three one zero minus one two and seven uh, four five and two uh, the determinant of a is minus 91 3 3 uh, a is equal to 2 uh, I just write 2 4 minus 3 this one is 2 5 uh, minus 2 uh, 2 5 and 8 so an 8 and minus 9 1 and 2 so determinant is minus four thousand or four hundred and forty one and number four number four I write a is a call. And matrix A is I put four by four. Is zero minus one three two three minus one. 1 and 0 and 2 minus 2 1 and 3 and 0 uh, 1 2 and 4 and 4 
and number five matrix A is equal to two uh let's just take this one. and this one I take uh this number is Three, three, two, Two minus six, and this one is minus one, two, uh, one, and zero. And the result is uh, determinant of A is minus. 418 418 and just take another uh, And number six, A is equal to uh, zero. One, two, zero. This one is one, zero, three, two. This one is two, minus two, minus five, minus one. This one is three, uh, minus one. One and three. This determinant of A is equal to nine. Four to nine. And seven. I write seven in here. Just take about A. Is equal to one zero 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 zero. I take uh, this one is two zero one three five. This one is uh, five zero one zero zero one I take uh, six five one two zero and I take this one is seven uh, uh, 
שואל, שואל, And five is one. This metric. So I have seven uh, exercise for you to practice about uh, determinant. And I hope all of you can do this uh, exercise. And don't forget to. Uh, practice about your exercise more and more. You will be get uh, it means that uh, your knowledge and the, finally. Uh, Finally, I want you to read this, uh, to watch this video, be carefully. And if you don't know about some point of, uh, of the way or the strategy to find about this metric, you can ask me when we uh, have one Google meeting or in meeting room, we just uh, talk each other and why we saw about this uh, determinant by this way or by other way and why when we change about the sum of uh, the row or the column why this determinant is change the sign also and when we take uh, one row to uh, subtract or addition with other row with uh, the constant, uh, the determin determinant is no uh, done change about the value is the same. But we take about this uh, constant multiplication with the row which we find, and plus the row we define is we just to divide by the coefficient of the row uh, our finding. So now the way to find about the determinant we have we have the first if three by three three by three it means that we can find about the determinant by zeros method if Determinant is 4 by 4 or 5 by 5, 6 by 6. We cannot find determinant by series. We just can find determinant by cofactor expand or by formula of row, formula of column. But when you find by cofactor and formula of row and formula of column, four metric, four by four, three by three, uh, five by five, I think it's more calculation. You spend much time. The easy way to find this determinant of the metric. 4 by 4 or 5 by 5, the best way is to solve by reduced row. Or you convert this determinant to the diagonal metric. Because when you convert to diagonal metric, you can find or you can find uh, the solution or the answer of determinant or you can calculate the determinant in shortly and easy to know and you have uh, you don't have spend much time you just have spend a little bit time to 
uh, find about this uh, metric or about this determinant of the metric 5 by 5 or 4 by 4 and 6 by 6. So I want to get some advice for you. If 3 by 3, okay, you can use Cirrus to help you. It's easy way. But 4 by 4, don't use about the row, column of row, uh, column, a uh, formula of column, the formula of row, or about the cofactor expand because you have much of determinant. If 4 by 4, the minor is 3 by 3. So you should be fine 3 by 3 4 times. If 5 by 5, 5 by 5, it means that you should be fine about the minor of 4 by 4 5 times. 4 by 4 and 3 by 3 4 times. Chung 4 by 4 5 times. Multiplication with 3 by 3 4 times is 15. 15. 15 calculation about the determine, determinant. So I think this way you will be spend my time to find about the determinant. The best way of 4x4 four four and 5x5, five five, the best way or best uh, uh, find the easy way is by about reduce row or row reduction. Row reduction is the best uh, way to find about the determinant of the metric 4x4 four four and 5x5 five five or 6x6. Six a uh, more than three by three, you just reduce row is easy than uh, other. Please remember about this point. And I think uh, we can uh, skip in this point about determinant. And the next video, the next video, I will. Uh, explain you how to find about the eigenvalue and about the eigenvector and i just explain you how to find about the diagonal metric uh, find about uh, diagonalism of the metric a because uh, diagonal metric of uh, metric a is very useful for our find about the uh, power of the metric A in bigger power. Example, you find about uh, metric A power 20, 21. So we cannot take metric A, multiply with metric A until uh, 2021 time. It is very uh, difficult for you. We cannot write. But when we find about the diagonal metric, we can do this in short way to find about the big power of the metric A. So next video, I will do this video for you about the eigenvalue, eigenvector, and about the diagonal, A, diagonal metric. Thank you very much for your watching this video. See you on our meeting room and See you by video for the next uh, step of our lesson. Hope you enjoy this video and hope this video, video to help you to know about how to find determinant in our metric 3x3, 4x4, 2x2 or 5x5. 5x5 I think maybe you should be researched by yourself how to find uh, by reduce row. And now I skip in this point and wish you good luck and get more knowledge from this video about determinant. Bye bye.